Hey, yo, what up there, little grinder? You know, welcome to today's video. Today, we're gonna do something a little bit different. I'm gonna load my bicycle up with camping gear and tiny whoops, and we're gonna ride it almost 60 miles away to a free campsite that I saw on Reddit. I'm not even sure if it exists. I just saw it was, let's go. Made it out of the city. Well, we're still in the city, but here, this path right here, we made it out of my neighborhood and out of downtown. This little trail you see before me goes out for, I don't know, hundreds and hundreds of miles. I'm gonna do like 47 of those miles beginning right fucking here. I'm very excited. I hope I don't die. I've never done anything like this before. Uh, Lord help me. <laughs> turn into the street i'm pretty sure that's okay except i'm gonna get fucking honked at by every single car behind me now so we're just gonna cruise in the road and uh hopefully find a trail somewhere down here all right here's the part that i was slightly worried about is they're doing a bunch of construction on the fucking schuylkill river trail the one that i'm taking and i just hit the first detour not too bad of the hill but fully loaded down fucking fixed gear 44 16 ratio this motherfucker's heavy as shit. I'm not making it up this hill. I could blast up hills, motherfucker, but this has a lot. There's a lot of fucking heavy things on this bike, so I ain't doing it. So, you know, kind of a welcome, a little reprieve to walk for just a second. 10 miles in, 35 miles to go. Making pretty decent fucking time, but gotta figure out how to get back on the trail. Detours are fucking me all up, man. So I am officially lost. I just climbed this huge fucking hill because I couldn't ride my bike up it. Almost to the end of it and I'm really just hoping once I get to the top of this hill, I'll be able to see something. Maybe a store I could ask the people, but I've like veered off to the trail. I veered off from my trail severely. Shit, shit, shit. I'm assuming it's left. We're just gonna go left and see what happens, fuck it. Yep, looks like I went way the wrong way. Up that hill was the wrong way, but fuck man. It says that's where the Schuylkill River Trail is, but I'm pretty sure, pretty sure it's blocked off right there. I don't know how the fuck else to get over there. You know what the, the, you know what the Schuylkill River Trail? No. No, do you know what the Schuylkill River Trail? Uh, can I get back on it this way going um, towards to French Creek? To towards French Creek. God, I'm feeling good. I am feeling fucking fantastic, dude. I am so glad I did this. I am so stoked. Like, I've been looking up videos and like bikepacking, touring bike shits for a couple weeks now, and I was like, I just got, I gotta do this shit. I don't know where I can go. And I saw that there's this 50 mile fucking ride, you know, which ain't really shit. 50 miles ain't that much. So it's like, fuck, dude, first fucking first trip. Got the bike all fucking loaded up, hell yeah. Can you see the bike? Yeah, let me show you what's on the bike. All right, let's just start with the bike. This is nothing special at all. This is just your fucking cheap ass $300 fixed gear, budget ass basic steel bike frame. And I got my little sleeping pad. I got this Origin 8 messenger rack on the front. Got the little sleeping pad. Got my rocket stove sleeping bag. Little tiny bag for my camera. Tent poles are Velcro strapped to the frame. Then I got this little rear rack with my tent and a stuff sack and then this green guru bag that has all my FPV shit, a little fucking and jacket and some uh, some other things the other things are weed the other things are actually just weed and then on the side here i got all my little snacks my bike lock my fucking spoon and shit this is just some little kids like front bag that i stole and well i didn't steal it but there that's my uh that's my first tour and setup i got a fucking gravel king in the back continental schwalbe marathon in the front or whatever it's called and it's all fixed gear all one gear 44 tooth chain ring 16 tooth fucking cog in the back six gear 20 miles Fuck them. Six more miles to Spring City. That's where we can fill up our water bottles and I think there's gonna be dabs there. And then after that, we have about 19 more miles or two more hours till we get to Douglasville, Birdsboro. I don't know where this campsite is. I saw on the internet that it's somewhere between these two towns. I'm hoping that I can just see it on the side of the road. However, I talked to this dude back there. We were chit-chatting. I told him what I was doing. And he's like, bro, if you can't find it, you can just camp anywhere on the river. I do it all the time. Cops don't give a shit. People do it all the time. So fucking perfect. If I can't find the campsite, I can literally just camp where the fuck I want along this river it's beautiful it's beautiful i can't i can't ride 
right up it. This is mile 37, and this hill's big. I just, like, I gotta walk it. I don't give a fuck. I said it is a fixed gear. I've been pedaling basically non-stop for 40 fucking miles. Now we made it to the head shop where we are going to be refilling our waters. I'm pretty sure this is it. This looks like, this looks like a head shop. All right, we got the waters filled up. We got the petted dog. Thank you very much, homie. I do appreciate it. Have a good rest of your day. I got about 20 miles to go. Find my campsite. All right, that was a decent little rest. For those of you that are only into this video because you want to watch the FPV parts here, I got you, I got you. I was going to wait till I get further up the road, but this is a beautiful little fucking area. I got my whoops packed up right here. So here you go, here you go. I'll do a little bit of flying and then we'll continue on down the road. <laughs> Fucking, we're here. We made it. <laughs> oh my god, that was so fucking random. That was so fucking random. I was just, oh god damn it, bike. God damn it, bike. I was riding, saw some deer over there, and I was like, oh, it's a pretty, it's a pretty deer. And here we are, the Fred J. Fred J. Doberstein Overlook uh, yeah, campsite. Let's go check it out. God. Can't believe I made it. I can't believe. <laughs> I can't believe I made it. Let's see. Let's see exactly fucking how far that was. I made it. That's the farthest I've ever ridden a bike in my life. I'm too fucking excited about it. Where is my phone? Let's see what Strava says. I'll screen cap this so I can put it up on the thing. 57 miles, five hours of riding. Holy fucking shit, dog. 57 miles on a fucking fixed gear. Loaded down with gear. <laughs> okay, beautiful campsite on the river. There's the water is just right there. Free. This is a free campsite. Nobody else is here. I was scared there's gonna be some tweakers here, and there's not. This is fucking amazing. I'm gonna go pitch my tent. I'll be right back. All right, the battery on this camera is dying, so I'm gonna throw it on the charger, but I got my tent all set up, ready to go. I'm, I might pass out in the next fucking 10 minutes, man. Riverfront fucking view. I got my little jet boil. I got some uh, some dehydrated food shit in here. I'm gonna make myself some food and just fucking relax. All right, so I had this Sawyer water filter. It's kind of fucking old. I've never used it. It's been in my closet for like four years. I've never used it. I just tried using it and I don't know, man. Uh, I don't know. I got some water from down there. I wonder if I trust it. I guess it tastes okay. So here's something that I kind of thought would happen. Made my little fucking lasagna here. Ooh, it's hot. It's good. But that was all my water. I'm out of water. So... Looks like about two miles away, there might be somewhere where I can get some water. So I'm gonna finish this. I'm gonna put my shit in my tent. I'm gonna put all my expensive stuff in my bag and take it with me. I'm gonna fucking bike another two or three miles to find some water to fill up my bottles. And fucking bike back and then relax. Then fucking chill. Jesus. All right, I just did three scary ass miles through the woods, but the bartender was super cool. Filled up my water bottles. Let's ride three scary ass miles through the woods. Back to the tent. Good morning, little grinder. He knows I slept shitty. I kept waking up. I kept waking up all fucking night. I'm not I'm not used to these sleeping pads. I'm used to my very comfortable fucking bed. 
This has been an amazing trip. This is the furthest I've ever bicycled in my life. On top of that, it's a fucking fixed gear, man. All right, I'm gonna get one last tiny whoop rip in. I'm gonna start packing up and I'm gonna head home. I got 57 miles to go. Yesterday, I was very energized. I was very excited about this. Today, I'm still excited, but I'm a little sore. So riding 57 miles home, this is gonna take a long fucking time. But thank you very much, everybody, for watching today's video. This is kind of some different content, you know what I mean? I didn't fly a whole lot of whoops in this one. I'm about to fly one right now, so stick around. I'm about to do my final rip. But if you like this content, if you like seeing me do other shit that's not just, like, going to fly drones exclusively, you know, let me know in the comments below if you like it or hate it. I'll either make more or I won't make more, depending on what you say. Regardless, thanks for watching this video. I promise next time we'll be better. Check out this tiny whoop rip. It'd be cool to end the video by running up the rocky steps and be like i did it i biked 100 miles but there's no fucking way i'm walking up those steps i'm just gonna go home and do dabs now thanks for watching <laughs> <laughs>